Welcome back, viewers. Today, we will be testing the moving VWAP indicator. But before we do, if you have not watched the first video on the channel and all the videos after that, you need to go do that now. Here at the Academy of Forex, we are building the best trading system possible as a team. And as a team, we will all profit from it when we are done. You can find a link to the first video down below in the description, and you should also see it pop up in the top corner right now. There is also a link down below to sign up for TradingView. You can save a little bit of money if you use the link below to sign up for your account. You can also find a link below to join us on Discord. Discord is a free group communication platform where we are having great discussions about all things to do with trading. Lastly, if you would like a list of all the indicators we have tested along with their win rates, but you aren't interested in watching all the videos on the channel, you can sign up for our $9 Patreon and you will receive the complete list of indicators. We also would like to introduce our Patreon exclusive Discord channel. As a $9 Patreon, you will be invited to join an exclusive Discord channel where we will give you a list of winning indicators and links for the MT platform, give you winning strategies, post trade ideas, give advanced advice, and much more. So click the link below to join our Patreon. All right, as I said, today we will be testing the moving VWAP indicator. Before we do though, I wanted to put the testing scoreboard up for everyone to see. So to date, we have tested a total of 27 different strategies with a total of six winners. We have also tested a total of 399 indicators with a total of 162 winners, which means that they have met or exceeded the 60% win-loss ratio threshold that we have set for them. The best ones so far were able to achieve a 100% win rate. Now you need to go back and watch those videos to understand the context of how they were able to achieve that. But as we are working on building the best trading system possible, you could take any one of those 162 indicators and get out there and start potentially profitably trading the markets with them now. So we'll go back and watch those videos, make a list of those indicators, and get out there and see what you can do with them. But stick with us here as we work on maximizing your trading profits. Okay, so today's indicator is the moving VWAP indicator, and you can see it here on screen. And so basically it's a slightly modified version of the standard VWAP. And uh, like most moving averages, uh, or the VWAP being a, uh, a, a moving average class, uh, what we are going to do is uh, try this with a price action break of the VWAP line there. And so when price action breaks up above, we are going to go long. When it breaks down below, we are going to go short. So let's see how this works and uh, get on with the testing here. All right, let's be mindful what we have happening here right at the very beginning. So very beginning right there, we pick up a short uh, price action breaks down below the VWAP line there. And almost immediately, it uh, breaks right back up above. Let's see. Uh, not quite on this one, but on that candle right there we got the break back to the upside. And in that case, that one did get us to take profit. Then over here on this side, right there, we get a break back to the downside. 
looks like that one got us to take profit as well let's just go ahead and double check yes it did got us to take profit there uh let's see so looking here this one let's see if we broke to the upside nope we did not slightly slightly under it there and so what i'm looking at here is i'm looking at the close of the candle so this right here the c uh, shows the close of whatever candle you are hovering over and if you look at the moving view op right here there's these numbers next to it which are its coordinates at that particular candle the close of that candle and so if you hover over say this candle right here and you look at the close of this candle we're we're trying to determine whether or not this candle right here actually broke up above you can see that so close to the line we want to know if it closed above the VWAP or slightly below it so we look at the close again right here at this one that is 0 0.85812 and then we look at the VWAP over here the coordinates of the VWAP and that was at 0 0.85781 one so we can see that the close of this candle was higher than the vwap coordinates the close of that candle which means that it did close above ever so slightly and so that's going to be a cross to the upside along there and it looks like we were able to barely squeeze out take profit on that then there we get another close cross to the downside and another take profit so so far we are doing pretty decent on this cross to the upside there and take profit once again now i should mention that i did change the uh, setting on this to a 30 period so anytime we test a moving average uh, i try to set the period to 30 unless uh, there's a specific reason why it should be on um, you know a set period the 30 period is what we had tested every other moving average on especially when we did the moving average head-to-head -head testing and so try to put like I said each moving average that we test on that 30 setting all right so we have a few moves going on here and a few take profits Again, moving along rather nicely let's see here so same deal on this candle right here I can't quite tell if we got a break to the upside or uh, whether or not it was just barely so again we're gonna look at the close and we're gonna look at the coordinates on the VWAP so the close of this is 84998 and the VWAP was at 8496 one so we did get a break to the upside just barely on that one but unfortunately you can see that on the very next candle we get a drop back down underneath looks like this one gets us to take profit yes indeed it does and then over here on this side we get across back to the upside there also getting us to take profit so so far we're doing really decent on this one uh most moving averages are get a little dicey so i'm not going to hold our breath on this one so uh what i'm going to do is go ahead and cut out some of the video here that way things don't get too long and i'll pick this up when we are at the end of the year all right so we are at the end of the year now before we add these up now would be a good time to say that if you are interested in excelling your trading knowledge, highly recommend that you join our Patreon only channel on our Discord server. You can find a link to our Patreon down below as well as a link to our Discord. Once you sign up for the Patreon, uh, once you sign up as a patron, then you will get access to the Patreon only channel on the Discord where we are posting some really great advanced information about uh, trading strategies, trading indicators, and trading philosophy in general our admin jay has also put together a rather lengthy list of winning indicators for the mt platform so if you use the mt platform quite a bit that would be a very handy list for you to have 
Our admins and our regular members are also posting regular almost everyday trade analysis, uh, market analysis where they're putting up screenshots of charts where they've marked out areas of support and resistance, indicators that they're using exactly where they're entering and exiting trades, taking profits, the whole deal. They're growing small accounts really quickly with the information that they're putting out for everyone to see. And lastly, uh, a new thing that I've been doing here recently is I put together an Excel sheet of all the strategies that we have tested, and it shows exactly which strategies were winners, which ones were losers, their win rates, as well as links to the videos to go back and review those strategies. So you'll get that full list as well as the full list of indicators that we've tested shows exactly which indicators were winners and losers and their win rates as well. And so a lot of great benefits to becoming a patron of the channel and it doesn't cost hardly anything at all. Highly recommend it. All right, back to the indicator here. Let's go ahead and get everything focused in here and let's count these out. So we have one, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, and twenty-eight. So we have twenty-eight trades all together, and we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, and 19 winning trades. That is not bad at all for a single line indicator, a single baseline. Uh, normally, uh, they do pretty bad, uh, especially when you get an area of consolidation like this where the indicator starts getting pinballed in. You can see it happen just a little bit right here. But it was able to avoid the majority of that uh, whipsaw, that pinball in and out uh, during a consolidation zone. And so very interesting that it didn't get quite trapped the way most moving averages do. And so I think that this now becomes the best moving average that we have tested yet on the channel. Uh, very interesting indeed. Yeah, I'm surprised by that. I uh, definitely did not expect much out of this, uh, considering how we've tested so many moving averages and the vast majority of them just perform uh, really, really bad. So, yeah, nice, uh, nice surprise to say the least. So this one is going to go on the yes list and we will move on to the next indicator from here. If you have not already, like this video, share this video, comment below and subscribe to the channel. Also turn on the bell notification so that way you are notified anytime I post a new video. So that way you know what indicators we have tested and are testing. Also there is a link down below to join our Discord server, which is a free group communication platform where we discuss all things trading related. There is also a link down below to TradingView, and if you use that link to TradingView to sign up for an account, you will save a little bit of money. And lastly, there is a link down below to sign up for Patreon. Please sign up for the Patreon and support the channel the best way you can.